anyone is at risk. Anyone is at risk for any of these uh, types of, uh, of crimes. Uh, so that's why everybody needs to, uh, to be aware. You could be the next victim. The FBI says kidnapping is done when victims are exploited through threats, demanding money. And in a day and age when technology is so rampant, so is virtual kidnapping. But what is it? It's when a victim is told that their loved one has been kidnapped, deceiving the victim over the phone. The innocent victims are tricked into believing that their loved ones are in danger and that the horror and hopelessness that they feel as they scramble to secure what they think will lead to their ultimate uh, release. But before you hand over that ransom money? Ask to speak to the, the person that they claim that has been that has been kidnapped. I think that's the key. Well, let me talk to them. Let me talk to them just to make sure everything's okay. Make sure they're still alive. Experts say they instill fear and panic, making some hesitant. A lot of them don't report uh, that they're victims of this crime. Uh, because that they're afraid um, of their of their immigration status. What I want to reassure the reassure the public is, the FBI is not focused on a person's immigration status. We're focused on them as victims and the victims of an extortion crime. Even so, you must be on high alert. If somebody does get a phone call like that, the first thing they need to remember is do not panic. Rosemary Montañez, ABC Seven.